Hello, Hello there. there, I'm Robert. And I'm Vanessa. And we are late to the party. Fresh meat! Fresh meat! Fresh fish on the line. Ain't nothing like it. Sometimes when you get old, they replace you with a younger, newer model. And you know what? Logan sent it off in an awesome way. That was kind of like the period at the end of the X-Men sentence. And we've been getting into this new era, which is cool because, I mean, technically it's not new. New the mutants exclamation point? You know what? That movie definitely was an exclamation point. You're right <laughs> about that. But we've got the new mutants finally coming. And they're not just leaving it to television, which they did with The Gifted. But we're getting the new mutants theatrically, and I'm really excited for it. Yeah, I'm excited to bring some fresh faces into the X-Men world, because X-Men, um, for the longest time, I mean, kind of was like the top poncho for movies, essentially, because um, people who weren't very, I guess, versed in comic book movies knew who the X-Men were. It's true, yeah. You had your your regular players, you had your top hits of the X-Men, and they had their run, but now we need to get into a little bit deep-seated uh, X-Men that we exists. Go deep. Yeah, the mutants that exist. I mean, it's a huge, giant world. So I'm so happy that Fox is tapping into this. Josh Boone, too. Josh Boone has been trying to get something a little scarier out there. Fault in Our Star, sure. I never saw it. People liked it. But all in all, Josh Boone has been really trying to get something cooking, at least in the horror world. And from what I've heard, they're starting to get that horror mixed in with a little bit of uh, the mutations going on in Fox's universe. So all right. let's take a look at the first trailer for New Mutants. Right now. now. Oh. My content. Caught my eye for a second, sorry. I'm going to ask you a series of questions. And I want them answered immediately. I want you to respond truthfully. Have you ever hurt someone? Yes. Yes. I had no idea she was going to say that, but... <laughs> Seriously? Little Pink Floyd? Okay. Have you ever experienced anything you'd consider... abnormal? Education. Next. Last question. Do you know what mutants are? <laughs> Did you know baby rattlesnakes are more dangerous than adult ones? They haven't learned how to control how much venom they secrete. It's a good explanation. All of you are dangerous. That's why you're here. Oh, damn. Okay. What is this place? <laughs> okay. It's in Harry Freddy. It's a haunted house. <laughs> You've been through a lot. Get some rest. <laughs> I know, I know, yeah, yeah, yeah the song's gonna be hey. stuck. Teacher, yeah. leave those kids. So, home. you think about it though. I'm, it, it's, Ooh, that was a. Uh, whoo! <laughs> got chills. Give me the chills. <laughs> it, it's, it's quite frightening though. You, you have to think that taking these mutants, putting them in some psych ward essentially, a, a school to try and harness their powers, you know or what, get though, them to realize who they are. The fact that. He Josh decided to go this route right. instead of making it the oh, I'm a superhero kind of thing and making it a little darker and grittier in there. I'm digging it. And that's the I'm thing. Excited. Is, that is an element that uh, that side of Marvel really has kind of emphasized on is the hunting down of these mutants, the corralling, the containing of these mutants. Now that lady looks familiar. Was she the same lady from Logan? I don't 
remember. Oh, okay. With the kids that ended up getting kidnapped and were harnessed maybe for not. their powers and trained. I maybe doubt I'm, it. I'm, maybe I'm thinking because I've seen her in other movies that I'm just trying no, to... No, you remember it wrong. <laughs> no, I know, but no, I'm trying, like, you know, like, I'm trying to associate her with something and that's, like, the closest, like... X-Men related movie that I'm like associate like I'm trying probably. to connect it somehow I but know. it's not it's probably not I went Michael, we'll see I, met, I went Michael Scott with it uh. you're remembering it wrong um, <laughs> but no we've got Maisie Williams and Anya Taylor-Joy two girls that have just killed it right now with their properties so first off I'll stick with Anya Taylor-Joy The Witch and Split that's all she needs. I mean, she won me over first with The Witch and then with Split. Like, she was one of my favorite parts about Split. You know, aside from the whole job. backstory with the M. Night Shyamalan universe, which also won me over in the music that came in at the end. You guys know what I'm talking about. But <laughs> Anya Taylor Joy was definitely uh, one of my favorite parts about Split. Yes. And then we've got uh, Maisie. She was great. And then you have. Macy, who is she killing a big deal it right now? Isn't it? She's killing it in Game she's of Thrones. Dude, she's a badass. Yeah, <laughs> she's crossing your name on that list, and for her, uh, I think that she she'll probably fit right into this role that she's been given. And then having like the the what was that horror movie that came out with the guy with the smiley face on his face? Smiley. It was it smiley. I'm yeah, that sure. that's what I kind of got from that going on. I got a little bit of the strangers too with that mask. Sure. In a way, I can and then see of it. course being in an insane asylum. Mm -mm. Which no, thank you. which of course we we say it's an insane insane asylum. It's probably more for just a facility. It's, for it's to... a school for gifted youngsters, but not where they get to run free with classes and. It's not training. Xavier's Correct. gifted school. Correct. Although it's more, uh, they were part of the Xavier. reins are tighter here for this one, but like I know that the, they were like in the comics and stuff part of Correct. Xavier's thing. The so X Men Academy. Yeah, as well. they're trying to. This is kind of like the it. precursor because they're showing them as like little kids as well. Yeah. So I mean that's frightening though to be a kid and she talked about the rattlesnake too. When you're a rattlesnake, you're more dangerous. And that's the thing is these kids, depending on their powers, are more dangerous then they can't control it Correct. it's almost kind of like with like like they said a lot of animals that are out there that are very venomous uh, yeah. they tell you to stay away from the the babies the children because yeah. they are more venomous than their human or their adult counterparts and so. what happens when one of them is just a bad egg what happens when one of them is not a good kid and that's yep. something I'm reading it, reading superpowers right now and they kind of cover that as well so I'm really excited for new mutants I can't wait April it's not that far away we'll get there yeah. and then I, I'm, I'm happy with Fox and the approach that they're starting to take let's focus on some new properties we still got Deadpool coming out as well um, so definitely can't wait to see more from new, new mutants, mutants. So thank you so much for watching our reaction to the new trailer for New Mutants. It is something that we are definitely putting on our calendars that we will see when it comes out. What did you guys think? You can comment down below, let us know what you guys thought. You could like, you could subscribe. And you could do the thing on our Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Stardust. Definitely check out our Stardust. It's gonna be where we give our instant reactions while these things are edited and rendered and uploaded. You can find out what we thought about these movies, TV shows, trailers, before they're available on YouTube. And you can hit up our Patreon, kick into the party, feel the party, keep the party going. Let us go where we need to go, which we are headed to Nightfall, Nightfall at Old Tucson Studios, Friday the 13th. So technically today, if you're watching this later, it already happened, check out for that vlog. But either way, we'll be shooting a vlog at Nightfall. It's basically an old trail dust town converted into a uh, haunted town with alcohol. Yeah. And I can't wait for it. So if you're in the Tucson area, head over to that. Either way, thank you guys so much. Check out our trailer reactions for Star Wars The Last Jedi, The Justice League. We did a couple Schmodown reactions as well. We do those every week. But either way, thank you guys so much. And now it's time, time to, to say, say goodbye. goodbye. Bye. Bye. Got that look in your eye. Fresh fish on the line. Ain't nothing like that shit.